video medias out there than myself. <laughs> oh, well, I can just watch myself over and over. Look, look, it's me. I'm, I'm watching me. I'm watching me. <laughs> oh, you're, he's so funny. I don't know how people just don't roll around laughing. He's so funny. He's so, so funny. But I need something to put my video game shell or video game stuff on, like a new shelf, or a couple new shelves. Where would I get those? Amazon! Oh, so many different gadgets. I think I look at too much stuff. A lot of computer stuff and what? Kids things. Oh, kids. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see, what should I order? <laughs> oh, this looks pretty cool. Atlantic Media Tower Elite for an elite game room. Yeah. 837 CDs. Who does CDs anymore? 630 Blu-rays, which means Xbox One, PS4, and I think it can hold... 531 Xbox original games. I'm gonna need two. I need two to make my room better. I'm gonna purchase. <laughs> Added to cart. Hmm. Let's check on the order. Do 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 Oh, there's two I ordered. <laughs> Let's track it. What? Delivered? Guess I'll have to go get them. I'm gonna have to go get that. Oh, those things are heavy. Oh, what's this? Kara? What's here? Oh, what? Well, holy cow, you can't. Hold on, let me help you here. Okay, all right, how are you lifting this? It's not heavy. It, it's, it's heavy. Okay, can you do me a favor then, little muscle person? Can you put it over here, please? What the heck? Caution heavy. And you didn't find this heavy? Get out of here. Oh, I don't know how she lift this, but let's get it out. Oh, it's so heavy. All that for this little box? Really? Oh god. Wish Kara was here now. Let's open it and put it together. Seen that before. Box inside a box inside a box. So, guys, as you can see, this is the what it's supposed to look like. We'll have to see if I can do that. It's upside down because here's the bottom. So the box upside down and it's really, really heavy. And Kara's not here to help me, so that's it. So, let's try and put this bad boy together. Let me tell you what I think of it. Is it worth the money? That is the key. Is it worth the money or is it junk? Instructions. I'm already lost. And the screws. It looks like a brace to brace it to the wall. I don't normally do that. My kids are old enough to know the 
you know, don't go pulling on the rocks. And if my cats do something stupid, good for them when they get hurt. I meant, not good, not good at all. So, first thing I want to say is I have a pile of wood. A pile of wood. And the backing, which has got that carbon fiber look. Another cool thing is it looks like it's got pre-done holes for the nails for the backing, which I thought was really cool because on other units that's not true and you nail and you miss and so on and so forth. This one looks like it'll all line up with stuff. Um, oh, it's all screws. Let's see how this quality works out. So guys, whatever you do, do not set your drill to drill or anything heavy because all you're going to do is rip this press wood pieces. I mean in the end that's all it is is press wood and you don't want to beat it up. I won't bore you with the whole entire build. We'll do, I'll do some, show it, do some, show it, do some, show it. And if I get injured, maybe not show it. I'm not the greatest builder. Actually, I'm not the greatest anything, but building is not really my forte. And usually I get hurt when I play around with tools. So that's why I'm going to close this knife. This shouldn't hurt me. Okay guys, so there's the bottom half done. As you can see, it's actually gonna be a pretty decently tall unit. Now I have to install the upper part. Sorry if you hear me breathing heavy, I hurt myself. I tripped over this stupid thing, smashed both my toes, and it hurt. Well, almost done. One thing I do like about this is the fact that everything is screws. Even the back panel. Now usually most cheap shelving are those little stupid finishing nails. And then after about a week or two of pushing your games on it, it uh, starts falling out the back and all your screws need to be rehammered in and so on. But at least with these screws that should not happen. But I will tell you this, be very careful because I split the wood already over on this one side and it wasn't cool. I don't know how many takes that's going to be. That's frustrating. I can't find a bit that I would consider proper for the screws. And it's frustrating me to no end. So I'm only building one of these tonight. After a lot of pain putting on the back panel, I'm not going to lie, it needs to be cleaned up. It is finally built. That's not scratches or anything, I just got styrofoam on it that I haven't cleaned yet. And as I'm cleaning as I'm Vanna White. But it is very back ready to fall. So this is a unit that does need to go up against the wall, clearly, or it's just my carpet, one of the two. But I find that kind of dangerous. I have split the wood in a couple spots. I am very, very upset. Just realized I split that spot. A couple outside spots. So this did not go together without wounds. But anyway, guys, I'll show you when I got some games in it. I'll give you my thoughts. Okay, guys, so my final thoughts. This. Uh, you're not seeing the games probably as clear as I want them to be. Um, lighting and everything in here is not quite done yet. But this is now a section in my game room. And in the narrow shelves in the center, you see what I did? I put Nintendo, regular Nintendo cartridges. Looks really cool. And of course, you just keep going down. I just started putting some filler as we go down to the bottom. Now, one thing I got to say about this unit 
it's very nice I will give it that it's pretty simple to put together I do recommend two people um, putting the back panels on as it is screws not nails it's very very anger making and I got very angry and you can see that I turned the video off at a certain point and just finished it um, but I do find this thing flimsy not as in flimsy as in uh, you can warp it around I find it not very sturdy as in standing on its own so I do recommend putting a couple screws through it and into the wall which is what I done to make sure that nothing bad happens once you put a lot of weight in here but that is a lot of weight on these bottom little shelf right here that's all holds it on is two screws actually sorry eight screws two in each piece going down but still it's not that strong in my opinion but overall for 125 bucks basically it's shipped to your home for free via Amazon Prime I do recommend it if you're needing a lot of space whether it be movies or games as in this is just my original Xbox collection now it has a new home and I can actually put about another I estimated 200 games just in that section right there so guys thank you for watching it's been sort of fun I don't like building I have one more to build for the other side of this unit as you can see the big mess still so these are gonna be on each side of my big entertainment center which is gonna look awesome I think and guys game over